Hey guys, so right in front of me there are five USBs from different brands all with the same generation 3.0 and all of the same capacity 128 GB and I have bought them from their official cell uh, brands so that there is no issue of a duplicate or uh, uh, illegitimate USB. What I'm going to do in this video is go one by one and run speed test on each one of them and then we will pick the one winner the idea is to give you a better idea that the the claimed speeds are usually not what they actually are so and the reason i am making this video is because a uh, few days ago almost uh, one week ago some person came to me and uh, that person asked me to uh, copy some data for um, her and uh, when i plugged in the usb started copying the data uh, it showed me a few hours uh, uh, the data was in this MacBook, and I, I was supposed to copy in the USB, which was I think either 20, 128 GB or 256 GB, Kingston of generation 3.2, so the latest generation. First, it showed a few hours, then uh, I just left it uh, and went, and I came back. It was showing me still multiple hours. So, what ended up happening is that it kept copying our. Uh, at least it was saying it was copying for two days and the copy still did not complete because it was still showing one, more than one day left now on this macbook which is a, like a fully loaded macbook pro 15 inch so i cancelled the copy and then i selectively copied some pictures and just gave because uh, i wasn't able to copy then i thought uh, many people are misled um, by duplicate or numbers so i thought uh, in this video i'm going to take five good usbs that i think if i was supposed to buy i would buy either one of these so obviously if you have an unlimited amount of money you can buy something else there are a lot of uh, uh, usbs in fact if you have money why not buy an ssd so yeah so the idea is to keep it cheap as possible uh, the standard i set was 128 gb so the results are not uh, different they remain the same generation same memory same bought from their official sellers so that there is no issue of uh, illegitimate or duplicate usb so what we are going to do is we are going to take these five usbs two on the one hand and So on the other hand and these are the five usbs and i'm going to run speed test black magic speed test on one uh, one by one on all of these usbs and we will see how they perform and at the end we will have a winner i will leave the link of the top two or three usbs on my video description as well in case you are interested okay so uh, this is my macbook pro 15 inch uh, i have a apple recommended otg the apple original so there is no uh, issue of otg as well uh, so that no one can claim that this is not the highest possible speed okay and now uh, let's bring each one of these usbs out and let's run the speed test okay let's go so i have the macbook open and let's start with the sandisk ultra player I'm using black magic disk space test. So, and you should be able to see everything I see. So, let's begin. All right, so we have 38.5 MB per second and 149.7 MB per second read speed. So almost 39 MB per second or 38 MB per second write speed, 150 MB per second read speed from this SanDisk Ultra. And now I guess it's time to unplug it and transcend. Let's try with the transcend. All right, so we have the write speed 12.3 MB per second on transcend jet flash and read speed of 39.7 MB per second. So very bad results for Transcend. Transcend is a loser. And in fact, let me 
keep rearranging them. Let's keep the winners on the right side and the losers on the left side. So here we go. And let's plug in the Kingston one. So loser is Jet Flash Transcend. On the left side, we have right now winner Sandisk as of this stage Ultra Flare. So we have the Kingston plugged in. Let's select the target drive Kingston. Okay, let's begin the test. All right. It's finished 10 MB per second write speed and 99 90.9 .9 MB per second read speed. Not looking good. I guess Kingston is also a loser. That's I mean 10 MB write speed is really bad. Then we have 90 MB read speed, that is also bad. Let's move to the Lexa one. Alright, so for the Lexa one. We have 12.9 MB per second write speed, again bad write speed and uh, read speed is 141.6 MB. So read speed is a, a good one but the write speed is really bad. So I guess we have to move next and let's move to Hick Semi M200. I think it is a brand under Hick Vision, the camera brand, I think so. So let's move to this one. This is the last one, so hope it gives us a good indication and a good good results as well. Because we have three losers now: we have Transcend loser, we have Kingston loser, and then we have Lexar loser. Let's select the target device. This is again Hixam is M two hundred. Let's start the test. really good results with the hicks i mean 200 m200 like i think it's the best write speed which is 52.1 mb per second and uh, either second best or the best read speed as well like 145.9 almost 146 mb per second so in my lie i mean in my version in this speed test you have the winner this is hicks Xami M200 3.0 flash drive, the winner. I think it also looks the best among all of these. It's almost at the same price as all these, and this is this gave the best results. So this is the winner in my speed test. I would definitely recommend this one. It is not only beautiful, it is durable, like the whole stainless steel thing. And if you are looking for something else, then this is a uh, runner up not the winner up so the second position uh, goes to sand disc ultra flare it's not as beautiful or durable as uh, for example this one for example this one has a plastic body on one side even though it has steel on the other side this one the black one can break so yeah but this one also gave good results so this is my second recommendation this is my first recommendation and these are the results uh, you saw them with your own eyes we have two winners and three losers for the dust bin these are the winners uh, you will find the link to buy each of these these are 128 gb variants you can buy any of them because uh, uh, the storage variant is uh, does not matter as the brand and the variant that, uh, that gave the, these results so buy any variant any storage obviously if you come down to 32 gb you will get a bit less speed than this one because as you increase the speed uh, storage you get more speed sand disc ultra flare runner up xmm -E 200 the winners give your feedback your feedback matters take great care of yourself bye